so now we're in Finkton proper. This sequence is going to be quite long if I remember right. Oh, well, let's, let's play through it. Ah, uh, can I buy things? I don't want any of those. That would be your gunsmith. Who sent you to find this person? Daisy Fitzroy. She's either a great hero or the worst of scoundrels, depending on who's doing the telling. She's good for an airship. I don't care if she's the Queen of Holland. Right. The path of the Vox Populi! Daisy Fitzroy lead her poisonous posse. The poisonous posse? To ruin nation! <laughs> Ruin nation, all caps, exclamation mark. For poisonous posse. Yes. Umbrellas, newspapers, no, no loot. Chen Lin gunsmith. Uh, clean and service $25, realignment work $100. Stock work $50, restoration service $75. Wait a minute. These prices are crazy high. Remember, we're back in the 1900s, like 190. What's the year right now? 120 dollars. That's in an insane amount of money back then. Those prices seem really off to me. Yeah, those those prices seem more like modern prices, to be honest. All right, well, that's that's really weird. Couldn't you like buy a house for those prices? I think you can. Uh, what are you guys doing here? More importantly, do you have loot? No, I need don't. There is a downstairs. There's a thing in the office. Do they care if I walk back here? They don't seem to care. Truth is, I don't have a lot of time for all that prophecy nonsense. I tell you, belief is, is just a commodity. And old Comstock, well, he does produce, but like any tradesman, he's obliged to barter his product for the earthly ores. You see, one does not raise a barn on song alone. <laughs> no, sir. Well, that's well, Fink uh, Timber. Fink, fink Timber's hammer, Hammer's 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 to swing We are not looking for any help. You hear that? No help. How are we going to get into Finkton? Illegally. Let's look for another way in. I can't believe how. Industries is not recruiting at this time. Please come again. The way this game interrupts its own audio is terrible. The truth is, I don't have a lot of time for all that. Prophecy nonsense. I tell you, belief is, is just a commodity. The old Comstock, well, he does produce, but like any tradesman, he's obliged to barter his product for the earthly ores. You see, one does not raise a barn on song alone. <laughs> no, sir. Why, that's Fink Timber, a Fink Hammer, and Fink's hand to swing it. <laughs> he needs me. Lest he soil his own. Alright, so there you go. So, Fink Industries is, are the people responsible for doing the actual work around here and doing all the construction and manufacturing. Elizabeth? Sure thing. And I guess exploiting cheap labor right. and slave labor is how they do it. So, remember at the beginning of the game, I talk about how the. Uh, all the temples and then the, the baptism place is really extravagant. And the game doesn't really show you... Already. Doesn't really show you the uh, economy that supports that extravagance. So now the game is telling you that it's mostly... Fink Industries. I found some money. Want it? Okay. Alright, so apparently Elizabeth has completely forgotten... The little running away episode just now. The volley gun... Hey, let me just take this and oh, oops! The volley gun does that. It's like a it's a rocket launcher.
Um, Alright, well, I didn't really intend to do that. Also, does not have much ammo. Does a lot of damage, but doesn't have much ammo. Um, I guess I need to go downstairs. Can I break this? No, no, I can't break that. No jobs today. Alright, let's go downstairs. We just killed a bunch of people. Yeah, pit locked. locked. Actually, what's on the other side? Got it. Over there, a service elevator. It should take us down to Finkton. And get ourselves killed in the park. No, Booker, you're the one who said to go down and find the gunsmith. Why are you complaining about getting killed now? I need a lock picked. It's like it's it's his idea, and then he's the one who's talking trash about it. It's done. Is this the same place? Okay, this is the same place. Oh, look, there's a Robo Washington down there. Can I get a rift anywhere? Do I get a, get a rift? No? No rifts? Alright, well, I guess we should ambush the Robo Washington. Like that. Alright, great. Did that guy do a magic side step? Like, did he just teleport to the to the left just now? Come on, come on, come over here. And dead. So once again, the moment you start firing, all the enemies just run at you and there's no strategy other than to just shoot them and punch them till they die. And that's the extent of the combat in this game. Nothing clever, nothing clever about it at all. What? Alright. Um. Okay, well, let me grab this and let me just walk around and find loot. Elizabeth runs in here. I think that means we're supposed to come this way. Why is she coming over here? The elevator's not here yet. Alright, lockpick. Okay, well thanks for not actually telling us what was in the journal. So Lady Comstock did not actually love the child and rather not have the child, apparently, according to Cornelius Slate, according to the journal he found. And we'll find out more about that later in the game. The game just slowly drip feeds the story to you. Look around a little bit. So expensive timber, right? And then wide open offices. There's really not enough tables. Given how interested Fink Here's was, cash. okay. Cash. Given how Fink keeps talking about efficiency and working hard and you know and all that, this is really uh, not the 
best use of office space. Like it's really kind of just open space with nothing in it. You can fit a lot more workers here if you wanted to. Uh, I don't need those. Interesting. This one doesn't sell lockpicks. Wanted Columbia Security. Chen Lin, wanted for known connections to the outlaw Daisy. Looks like and our guy's drawn attention. That's not good, is it? No. All right. Wanted for known connections for Daisy Fitzroy. So Chen Lin is apparently already making guns for Daisy. Requires one pick. Oh, it's only one pick. Well, let's pick it. On it. So these safes usually don't have anything useful. Ready. Although this one is only one pick, so it's yeah, see like that, it's only $166. Kinda not even worth the, the pick. So that's why I saved the pick for loot that actually matters, right? Uh this is the same as before. I don't know if I should upgrade the pistol as well. We don't really ever use it. Or the shotgun. Never mind. Escape. Ah, uh, alright, now what am I supposed to be doing? Oh, defected. Service elevator to think the like for a service elevator. This is a really, really fancy entry to a service elevator. It doesn't really make sense at all. Because there's no what are you looking at? I picked that up already. They're like, there's no, there's no other way to to get to Fink Industries except the service elevator, which is the most important thing in the in the room because of the central location. Yeah, it really is is odd. This layout, this layout is really really odd. Because we came in. Hold on, let me just go back up. I want to, I want to see this. Service elevator to Finkton. So, if you were a worker and you wanted employment, main elevator to Finkton proper is here. Okay, so, so this is the main elevator. So you kind of just sign in, get a job, and then use the main elevator to go down, right? Alright, so this is okay. And then employee is only the offices down here. The service elevator is actually right the underneath the complaint I hear from the working man is that they are unhappy with their lot. Oh, why torment yourself, I ask? The ox cannot become a lion, and why would you want to? Who wants all those responsibilities and worry? You do your job, you eat your food, you go to sleep. Simplicity is beauty. It's Slate's locker. He must have worked here. Uh, this is my mother's diary. Why would Slate have it? My husband claims the child was created from whole cloth by divine will. I am a believer, but I am not a fool. His bastard shall not be raised under this roof. My mother... She had me locked in that tower. Elizabeth. I just want to get out of this city. Please. Uh, well, no. The bastard. Lady Comstock is not your mother. Your mother didn't lock you in the tower because she's not actually your mother. So there's the journal there. There's Slate's locker. Okay, so the main elevators are like right next to the service elevators according to the plan. And there's an office down here in a service that uh, is, is a bit strange. It's a bit strange, the layout. I mean, as a... As a gameplay area for shooting dudes, it makes sense. Crazy. For an office, my it doesn't. My name is Jeremiah Fink. And I want to share with you my personal creed. What is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee! Have you ever seen a bee 
on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? <laughs> well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, be the bee. Be the bee. Think propaganda? There's propaganda in a service elevator? It's not the main elevator, it's the Maybe service. This makes no sense. Uh, hello? Mr. DeWitt? Uh, yes? Hold for Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? DeWitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top! <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems... Oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. Yeah, well, I'm gonna kill him probably. Well, the man's got an ego. Giant golden statue of himself in front of his factory. <laughs> <laughs> 